Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 44, and this is war number three. And we're going up against an alliance called Astonishing X-Men. All right, so let's see, who did they ban? Mmm, Silk, Void, and Cassie. Okay, and those are your global and ban immune attackers. All right, let's see who they have planned for us on defense. We're getting a little bit more used to uh, the nodes here. All right, so... Mmm. Interesting, interesting. So I could probably use Gallon. I think Gallon works on um with the hmm. Trying to think if uh the armor ups that infamous Iron Man, I mean not infamous, uh Iron Man Infinity War gets also help Gallon. But right now I'm thinking of Gallon. Ooh hoo hoo. Got somebody for you. Corvus coming back. Okay, so Gallon and Corvus. And who do we got here? Hmm. Each buff get a power charge. Knock him down. Okay. And Domino. High energy diet. And let's see, we got Quicksilver, these are hazard shifts, and I will leave those to the guys who do that well. Mm -hmm. Okay, ebb and flow knockdown. Usually somebody brings in Titania for this guy here. So... Gallon, Corvus, and I can take this Domino, and I may bring Hercules again. Shouldn't be too bad. And what do we got up here? Okay. And this one, I see why they, um, hmm, that'll be an annoying fight. All right. If they need me there, we will talk about it. But right now I'm thinking Gallon, Corvus, and Hercules. Corvus could probably take out all of these. Yeah. I'm worried about the infamous, I keep saying infamous, but that Iron Man. But other than that, I think Corvus could take out every tech on here. Hmm. Still rather bring, I'll ask them, but Gallon might be unneeded. So I might just bring in Corvus, Hercules, and then have someone free to take another one of these. Let's see. So, 
it would have to be one of those on boss i guess that's boss island now there or one of these but these are hazard shifts so i usually leave those so we'll, we'll talk about it and see what they say Um, I might bring, uh, Nick Fury. Let me see. Hmm. Never mind. Debuffs. Yuck. They know you, we like to use Nick Fury against him. Hmm. And stunning reflection. I really don't do well with that. Okay, yeah. Ugh. But I might have a counter for some of these. So we'll we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Gallon, Corvus, and Hercules, but maybe drop Gallon and bring someone else for another. We will see. All right. Let's get on with the fighting. All right. Corvus is coming to war once again, as is Hercules. Two people that I have not brought to war in a very long time. And we've also got Gallon, a favorite, and we've got some Gallon food for him to eat, 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 eat up. All right, so I was actually kind of nervous about this first fight because the armors that Iron Man Infinity War get, I'm like, okay, if they trigger the node, he's Gallon food. If they don't trigger the node, I can still do it, but it's just going to be a little bit of a longer fight. And um, if it doesn't trigger, you know, benefit from the node, I could have used someone else, but really doesn't matter. Gallon is awesome. All right, so I'm boosting up. Now, I want you all to note the time on these boosts, okay? I didn't use these before because of the way the map was set up. And the difference in time zones meant that we were not going to be done within the six-hour time frame. All right? So you see I also um, boosted up with a, a invulnerability because they're expiring. All right? And I got all happy. Look at that. Already the invulnerability you um, paid for itself here. Uh, but I got happy and I forgot about his auto block. So I was like, okay, my bad. Let's slow it down. And I'm watching now and you can see I'm building up, building up. Got my heavy attack off. This is Sparta. And he's done. Gallon food. Mwah. Beautiful. So now I know that don't have to worry about him with Gallon. And that's okay because we have options, as you know. They can't ban everybody. So if they ban Gallon, I'll bring somebody else. It's all good. Now, with this fight, I actually like this fight, okay? Because Omega Sentinel gets armor ups like crazy if you're not careful, okay? So. What I do with her is what I'm normally going to do, medium, light, medium, right? But then I'm like, you know what? Look at, look at how much it's going up because of her armor up, right? I'm just like, yeah, look at this. Bam. Let's finish this off nice and quick. And done. Mwah. Beautiful. Yummy, yummy, yummy. So as I said, gallon food. If they don't ban Gallon, and they got folks on this path, they get armor ups, tan them up. Now, if they do ban Gallon, and with those same ones, I would have probably bought my name more. He would have done a good job as well. Or Hulkling. He would have also done those fights very well. All right, so now I actually waited. Look at the time. Look at the time, y'all. I waited until somebody used those because I thought I was going to be able to reach all on this one, but I miscalculated a little bit. 
But more on that in a, in a moment. So this fight here, Ant-Man Future. Remember what he did to my bae? My baby! Claire? Yeah, we got some uh, revenge coming on. So you can see here, look at the boosts. I still got my six-hour boosts active. So you know how long it's been. And I'm already in section two. I love the change in the map because I'm not having to wait for anyone anymore. Only energy. So now we're going to see how uh, Corvus handles this Ant-Man future on this node. Now, the one thing I was kind of worried about was whether um, the bleed, he doesn't take any damage from bleed debuff, right? But there are certain effects that he will take damage from. But look at this. Just look at this. Nasty. Just armor breaking. Oh, yes. Mm. Okay. Throw that. It don't matter. Corv is coming for you. Remember what you did to Claire? Yeah. Revenge is here. Go ahead. Toss it off. Toss it off. That's fine. Mm hmm Don't matter. Parry. Armor break. Boom, boom. Boom. Yeah. Okay. Not quite dead yet. It's all good. Mmm. Yeah. Come on, come on, come on. Ooh, yeah. And I'm watching the um, the the uh, charges, which is why I started hitting into his block, because I'm still doing damage into the block. Yeah, dude, you can stay on that block if you want to. You're still going down to Corvus. Corvus is a beast. Still a beast. All right, so down went Ant-Man Future like he was nobody got revenge for Claire. Now, another thing that I didn't know until I had already done all my fights, we're in tier one. This is a tier one fight. This is a tier one war. Didn't know. All right, so you can see here, I got um, shock on me, but guess what? He don't take damage from shock. And look at me healing. Nice. I'm running the recall masteries and I don't care. Woo, look at that. Oh yeah. Yeah, we had to finish it like this. Yes. Ooh. How you doing? Mmm. Nasty. All right, so here is where I miscalculated. All right. So look at the uh, amount of energy I have left. I thought I was gonna be able to go right in. Cause see, I got two energy, right? But I forgot. That takes an energy, and so does that node right there. Bam, now I don't have any energy, all right? But watch this. Watch the time, it's gonna flip real quick, okay? And I want y'all to see the time that I have left, all right? Because I'm, I'm timing it like crazy. Okay, look at that, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Got the point, right? Now watch this. Look at the boosts. Look at the boosts, especially the cosmic boost. Look at that. Nine seconds, eight seconds, seven seconds. That's how close it was. I was waiting for it. And I said, yeah, I got it. So I didn't use any of the um, gray boosts or anything like that, but we don't need it. It's Domino. Look at that. Oh yeah. What you got, Domino? Mm. We remember you from long time. Now, the only thing that I did not want and why I wanted to um, uh, maybe put on another invulnerability boost was if she got super passive and didn't want to do anything but a special three. Then the invulnerability would have helped, right? Um, but I didn't have time. I said, nah, let me just go. All right, but she fired that off, so we're good. Just beating her down. I'm not even worried about the um, special two. All right. Yep. You can do that. All good. And I keep getting the power drain, but that's fine. We got a relic. <laughs> Beat upside the head with a hammer. All right. Now we got to bait this out again. Come on. Give it up. Give it up. There you go. Looks good, but it ain't hitting nothing. Whoop. Nope. 
One of the things I love about Hercules, he's hitting hard. I don't really need the special. Whoa. Uh -oh. She got that uh, lucky evade, but I was ready for it. Didn't want to evade that one because we still had that uh, debuff on us. We were unlucky. Look at that. All into her block. Didn't matter. That's what's up. Hercules! So that was it for my fighting for this war. Tier 1, the first Tier 1 war I think I have fought. I'm not sure. S certainly never done that with these guys. So we'll be back in a moment, and you'll find out how this war ended. And we're back, and aw, yeah, we won this war. We have been on a winning streak. First three wars of the season, and we have won. See down there? Bottom left-hand corner, Tier 1 War. Oh, my goodness. And these guys uh, have some real bangers on their team. Uh, one of our guys uh, warned us there are some master level players playing in this alliance. You know, it's not full. And I guess that they, you know, um, got tired of the uh, master level um, rat race, I guess. I don't know. But. They switch masteries for different fights. It cost them a lot. One of the guys said that um, one war was like 400 units. Spent 400 units on a war. No, thank you. That ain't me. So that could be why they want to, you know, go down uh, to a more relaxed uh, alliance. Anyway, that is going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed this. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.